Hey there and welcome back to my channel and if you're new, welcome to my channel and thank you so much for being here. If you're new, make sure you subscribe before you leave and if you're a returning subscriber, if you haven't already, hit that little bell down below for notifications on when I put up new videos. I try to upload two times a week. <laughs> All right, so as you are seeing from the title of this video, I am doing, well, it's kind of like a stretch, kind of like a yoga routine. Since I have been quarantined and all of us have been quarantined, I know how important it's been for me previously to do things every single day to move my body. And a lot of you have asked me, what did I do up until this point being somebody who worked from his home and being somebody who actively had to make decisions in my life to get that movement um, and interaction and all of those things that maybe some of us are dealing with now that we're isolated, now that we're working from our home. And for me, it is super, super important to stretch and do some form of like very light, very beginner yoga. I sort of use things that I've picked up from videos that I've watched, just some stretches that I've done previously that have felt good for me. I have had one one-on-one -on -one beginner yoga class and learn things from there as well. So I just thought I would show you what I am doing. By no means am I a professional, by no means am I trying to claim that I know what I'm talking about. I just wanna show you guys what I do, what has worked for me, my body type and what feels good for me. I have a lot of shoulder pain, neck pain, um, and stuff like that. And I'm also just trying to build um, the ability to balance more. I wanna be a little bit more flexible. So those are my goals out of all of this. And um, as I've been doing it more and more, and I've you know been doing it pretty consistently for about two weeks now, I noticed that my body is starting to feel a little bit more limber in areas and like a little bit more agile, which is really nice. So I'm already starting to see some progress in my own routine. I won't keep you guys waiting for too much longer though. I will get right to the video. So grab a snack, get comfortable or stretch along with me and let's get started. Okay, first and foremost, I wanna apologize if you can hear my dishwasher in the background. I just kind of wanted to walk you guys through a little bit of what I'm doing. As I mentioned in the beginning of this video, this is just sort of stretches that I've picked up along the way and things that help me and make my body feel a lot more agile. And that's basically all I'm really looking for right now. The first thing that I like doing is this particular pose. I don't know what it's called. I've been doing it for a couple of years. It really helps with the tension in my shoulders. And one thing I will mention is when I do it, I tend to notice that I might be tensing up my shoulders a little bit more than I like. It's really important that when you do this pose, you just kind of allow your body to fall naturally and completely let loose. That is the best feeling in the world. This next position is pretty standard. It is great if you're having back tension or any sort of back pain. It is such a good way to stretch it out. You're really gonna want to pay attention to your breath here. I take a big inhale with the upward arch, big exhale with the downward arch. It may look funny, but when I'm in this position, which is already so calming and so great for just kind of releasing those muscles that don't get used very often, I like just kind of pushing into it and stretching myself a little bit more. This is one that I find to be super helpful for calming myself down and for just releasing a lot of those tense muscles that I have.
So I went a little bit off the cuff here. These are definitely not actual stretches that I've seen. I just kind of wanted to move my body in ways that I felt it needed. If you guys know more upper body stretches, things that work out your shoulders, your arms, etc., I would love to hear them in the comments below because right now, a lot of what I've been doing has been more lower body focused. to leave in the fact that I was struggling to balance here. This is one of the main areas in which I want to improve. I don't have the greatest balance overall, but I want you guys also to know that if you're doing this yourself and you are struggling to balance in certain ways, that's okay. I have a couple of things here that I can use to keep me upright if need be, but this is sort of like an important part of it that I wanted to leave in if you are a total beginner like I am. basically it for what I do in the morning to kind of just stretch out my body, get started on my day. You can see it's pretty beginner, pretty basic, but every single day I find more and more improvements and a little bit more flexibility. And then eventually I'll start adding in harder things as time goes on. I wanted to leave you guys with the absolutely beautiful and serene view that I get to take in every single morning when I do this. I really hope you guys like this video. Let me know what you think in the comments below and I will see you guys next time.